In this episode of Jonathan's World, we're first going to look at the carnivorous plants Dr. DeMarie has in his classroom. Then, Dr. DeMarie is going to feed a spider to a Venus flytrap. Afterwards, we're going to see the madness in his house with all the plants and uh, have a look at his fridge. See you later. This is Jonathan's World. So I'm in DeMarie's classroom. As, as you can see, there's a bunch of uh, plants behind me. And he has a carnivorous plant um, tank. It's full of carnivorous plants and ferns and things like that. Uh, so let's have a look. Here you see the pitcher plants. It's pretty big. It has a nice flower. Uh, Cephalotus. Cephalotus, the Australian pitcher plant. There's a sundew. Uh, some utricularia. Um, ferns, ferns, uh, fly traps. And a lot of interesting things. More, more sundews down there. Uh, Venus fly traps out here. Let's cover them up. Utricularia. The small sundew. There's more sundews. Fly traps. In here, there seems to be a bunch of utricularia. Uh, more fly traps. Oh, this is a beautiful sundew. Look at that sundew. Beautiful. There's your triple area over there. Some ferns, some more sundews in the corner. Uh, Venus fly traps, more sundews. More sundews. Oh, uh, there's a beetle. Oh, he's left a leg behind. Crap. Oh, oh, leave it in there. Leave it in there. Oh, move your hand. I don't want him to jump. <laughs> he is not going to jump so well without a leg. He's scared. Oh, oh so old. Oh, All right. Oh, oh that's <laughs> Jasmine, and it smells really good. Mm. This is cute plant. Oh, that's related to hibiscus. They call them sleeping hibiscus or sleeping hibiscus because they never sleep open. Huh. And, uh, this, this big leaf thing, I saw you looking at them earlier, this was a... Nemocaria species walking iris from Brazil. It, yeah. It doesn't have a name on it, but it should make gorgeous iris like it look, flowers. Yeah, that's what I was thinking that it looked like iris. Yeah, there is a. Just kind, like the way the leaves are. Iris, it's not uncommon in Florida that people grow. Jim, I do. If I see sprouts coming up, they go into the lights. They get enough of a chill in this room that things that require stratification, if it's not serious cold, they require but like chill. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm.